in this problem, we have our product, which is a cyclopentanol derivative. And we want to prepare this starting with this cyclopentenol. And sometimes this OH will throw people off. But I want you to keep in mind that alcohols and carbonyls are only one step apart. So remember, if you have an OH functional group versus a carbonyl functional group, you can go from the alcohol to the carbonyl by an oxidation. You can go from the carbonyl to an alcohol via a reduction. For this particular synthesis problem, I think it's almost as easy just to start in the forward direction. So let's start with our cyclopentenol. And a common mistake people will make is to try to add the cuprate right now. That won't work because you need an alpha-beta unsaturated carbonyl. So what we need to do is an oxidation. This is a secondary alcohol. You can use any of your oxidizing agents. I'm just going to use PCC. Now I have the alpha-beta unsaturated ketone. Next, we can add the cuprate. What cuprate do we need? We're adding this vinyl group. So I want those two carbons attached to the copper and the lithium. And the way I'll represent two is just to put parentheses around that group with a two. So we'll do this reaction. And that adds the vinyl group to the ring. Now we need the alcohol. And to get to the alcohol, we just need to do a reduction. This is a ketone. You can use LAH or sodium borohydride. I'll just use sodium borohydride. And there's our final product.